pass that he made it was right there during halftime at Bowles where he almost spoke to him. Very close. Beautiful pass underneath and stood. Right angle three on the way and good. They'll run the weave. Thompson outside. DJ Stewart, free. Sioux Falls kicked it ahead for Mike Smith on a driving attack. Woodard with a block, but Stewart there. Courtesy of the player's trunk. DJ Stewart looking to drive again. He will take it using length. Also similar to the first quarter, struggled from the floor early on. Oh, what a move for Dan. Yeah, that's like four points off of four uh, Sky Force turnovers in the first quarter. They have seven points. 6-9 forward out of Florida State, averaging 15 points a game. Pull-up jumper, D.J. Stewart puts it in. Potter straight away, high out right. Drive into the lane by Stewart, left hand up and good. Puts the Clippers on top. Then the first 90 seconds of this second quarter. D.J. Stewart to the rack. Count it! Oh, a beautiful bounce pass by Mario Chalmers. Drains a jumper. Oklahoma City 9 and 4 when leading after one. Sioux Falls 6 and 10. So they've come back down in the first quarter six times. For the Clippers. Sky Force second chance. Three minutes gone by. Final game of 29 after showcase. 9 4 the score as DJ Stewart takes it in and scores. They love when they assign players to the Sky Force. The only focus that they have when they're eligible prospects from last year's Ignite team. You have Principal Singh who is drafted. For the winter showcase, he's had some up and down moments with three points you didn't call and then has so far at the NBA. Five. Pick and roll. DJ Stewart finds the seam. Off the dribble. In the lane, the jumper is good. Wanted a foul, didn't get it. Jason March has his arms in the air begging for the foul. Yeah, I thought Jefferson got hit on the arm when he went up right there, but no calls. Cannon got a hand on the pass, but Chalmers gets it right back. His lob for Stewart, who lays it in. Stewart going again. That post up on Woodard. Fadeaway jumper in the mid range, and that he's on a two way deal and is an NBA player. And the recent rule change at the NBA would allow him.